Well, hello, and how are you today? I've got such a great treat for you. Uh, I'm working on some snacking today. Um, I can't tell you how many times a day I hear, what do I eat, cat? What do I bring to work with me? What do I snack on when I just have that craving for something sweet after dinner? Well, here's the thing. I, I suggest truffles. And it's not any ordinary truffle. I'll show you how to make my kind of truffle. So let's start with three of my powerhouse ingredients that I have in my kitchen I use all the time. One is turmeric, and you've heard of turmeric for its uh, anti-inflammatory properties. The property of curcumin that you see advertised a lot, it's, um, that's what's in the turmeric itself. So we're going to start with turmeric, and we're going to do the same, same exact thing, method-wise, with matcha green tea. And that's another wonderful thing that I have in my kitchen. So we've got the turmeric in one bottle and one bowl, and we've got the green tea in another bowl. And what I've done is uh, I'm going to sweeten this truffle with stevia. Now you don't have to use stevia. You can use coconut sugar, you can use honey, whatever natural sweetener you like. I'm just doing this <clears throat> with stevia because um, I, I kind of like it. And it's uh, a lot of people don't do well with sweetener, so I would suggest uh, sweetening with stevia. It's not going to raise your blood sugar. All right, so we're going we're gonna to add some coconut mana which is gold. I eat this stuff by the spoonful. Wonderful, good stuff. Coconut oil, um, this is actually the, the coconut flesh, not really the coconut oil. So it actually has a tiny bit of protein and a little bit of fiber along with the oil. So super healthy. Um, it actually helps you. Eating uh, coconut oil helps you to burn fat. So let's start with this. What I've done was I have about a teaspoon, a heaping teaspoon of turmeric, about a little less than a teaspoon flat of the stevia and I'm going to add a heaping teaspoon of my coconut mana. Okay, so this is going to be the same method for both. Okay, so we're just going to stir it up and you're going to want to make sure that that mana is room temperature so it's, it's easy to mix. So when you open up that jar it's going to be kind of crumbly, kind of hard. So you just want to stick it in a bowl of hot water for about 5-10 minutes, let it soften a bit. So we're going to stir this up, take about five minutes for it to come to temperature because as you stir it, you're actually going to warm it up a bit, okay? So we're going to do that. See, it's kind of warming up, forming a paste. Perfect. Excellent. So we've got that all warmed up, ready to go. So that's ready for either piping in a little pastry bag or forming uh, with your hands. Now we're going to do the exact same thing with the green tea. All right, so we've got a tablespoon coming right up. And we're gonna stir it all up. Again, we've got that seasoning or the sweetener in there already. And depending on what you like, you can use whatever. Now I use a little bit less matcha in here because it's very strong. Instead of a teaspoon, like I did with the turmeric, I used about mm, maybe a quarter to a half a teaspoon and the same amount of stevia and the same amount of um, coconut mana, all right? so. Ready to be mixed here, almost there. I think we're there. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. Making sure our hands are nice and clean. This is great for kids, by the way. All right, so we're gonna take our little, form a little ball with our little truffle, with our little turmeric. We're gonna make a little ball here. And there it is, all right? And we're just gonna put it on a plate. Now, I suggest either greasing in this plate or putting, um, putting a sheet of either wax paper or parchment paper, that would be better. So you see our little ball here. We're gonna do the same thing with the green tea. You might wanna wipe your hands here. Okay, so same thing with the green tea. And this might be a little bit softer. So again, you have to kind of, it's kind of like silly putty in a way, but it sticks to your hands a little bit. Now, if it sticks to your hands too much, no big deal. You just make a little droplet on the plate and then just stick it into the uh, freezer two minutes, take it out, and it's gonna be much more pliable. All right, so that's that. Now, I'm gonna show you the finished product, and you are going to not believe how pretty. Now, what I've done is I've uh, encrusted the truffle with my favorite things. So, with my turmeric truffle, I encrusted it with some cacao nibs, and with the green tea, I did some pumpkin seeds. You don't have to do that, just an idea. So here we go, here's a little green tea, cute, duh? and the little turmeric. Wonderful, so great snack. Now, beware, you cannot take these on a hike. 
they're going to melt and turn into goo. So um, they're really ready for the refrigerator. Keep them in the fridge or in the freezer and enjoy whatever you want. Mm, so good. Have a nice snack.